Well, look what I got. Hopefully my phone starts to um, focus a little better. There we go. I got a little box in the mail today. It came, a new Bible. Um, little blue box, white bottom. So I'll say a thank you, Eric, again. Um, someone I've been subscribing to. You know who you are. I just said your first name. Uh, kind of been doing a... A lot of shipping back and forth, kind of gifting slash trading, you know. And, um, and it's really working out every time. Um, I had a mid-size Thompson change CBP. That was my first. Uh, this is my second CBP. It's my sex second Thompson chain. Um, this is my second time making this video, so I'll try to do it a little better. Um, and I say some of the specs because someone might tune into this video and they're new to it. Um, it's eight and six eighths tall, and we'll call it six inches wide and an inch and a half thick. You saw the spine. Um, very subtle, uh, what do you call them, raised spine hubs. And there it is, Holy Bible, red letter. You can read it, CBP. Um, this is uh, my second calfskin like this. I have an old LCBP 180 series, and it's, you know, it's got that nice tooled, like, What's my well, whatever it was called the executive? I'll just say it, but it's got that tooled line, it's just very sharp, you know. It's I gave you the it's the Thompson chain reference, handy size, six point font, red letter. Um, but there's that stitching all the way around, top, bottom, front, back. Um, there's the calf skin, iron calf skin, sorry, synthetic liner. There's that stitching. And I was kind of noticing this. You got some, you got a little bit of pleating there, that pleated corner. That to go. It got a little bit. That's really nice. I was noticing that. Uh, th this little video is going to be more just talking about my new Bible. Um, and Eric, thank you for the extra. I put it in the email. I'll leave it at that. Um, got a little bit of overhang, you know. Hey, light. That helps. And then there was light. It comes with two ribbons. And got the sewn binding. I know we always hear Smith sewn, Smith sewn. Uh, edge lined, you know, there's the liner put into here. I thought the light would be too much, but. Uh, so, uh, got the gold. Nicely done. Yeah, it's got that thing going, but Eric covered that well enough in his video. Um, what I was surprised about this is I had the mid-size CBP Thompson chain with the white thread. Um, it wasn't the Thompson chain per se, and it wasn't Church Bible Publishers. Um, it just, I don't know what it was. I don't know. But um, I got this handy size six-point font. And I'll just start by saying, you know, um, and I, I'll say this again. If you want more on the Thompson chain reference Bible, that's the text block. CBP Church Bible Publishers does the binding. Again, many people know that, but I'm just saying it in case you're new. Um, this Usually when you get small Bibles, to, in my experience, maybe I don't get the premiums enough in small size. But those, those, are, those are the ones that are tighter, stiffer spine. Um, you know, you got to use three hands to open it and read it. and you know, um, This one, I don't know if it comes like this. I don't know if the previous owner really knows how to work in a Bible. But this opens up in a way I, I, I was not expecting, I was not used to. Wherever you open up, it, it, it's got this air. It's, it's completely like free back here. Let me do it again. And let me spill it all over the table. See, there it is. It's got this gap, and I, I, I did never thought of it. I like that. It's a softness to it. It's like there's, you know, it's an empty area with like air there. It just, it's like bubbly and it opens all the way up I mean I one thing about Thompson chain before I ever got him and I just watched reviews I was like oh this stuff uh, it always looks like it's running into the gutter this one has room to spare and I just you know not, it's not just that it's the size it's also the Thompson chain tech text block and I don't care about cockling you know, I'm pushing kind of hard and you can barely hear anything so there it is Six point font, you know, camera's zooming in so it makes it look readable, but 
you know, if you have any issues with small font, you probably don't want to get this one. Get the midsize, get something else. I mean, but, um, but it's dark enough for me and bold enough for me, especially as I sit here under this light. Yeah, I can read it. I'll be using it. I'm going to enjoy using this. Not just because of the construction quality either. It's I'm really giving the Thompson Chain reference a chance. Um, anyway, so I'll page through. You know, and, and I'm no expert. I haven't looked at a lot of pages. But, you know, the red letter seems very tolerable in this one. I mean, I know there's pinkish in some areas. but And, and sometimes the size of a font, you know, will change a perception. Um, you know, so it kind of looks different. But there we go again. So I'm just kind of showing that again. But um, let me get to some red letter again. Um, yeah, I mean, it looks like it's very well put together. You know, I, I, I've seen worse red letter, so I don't know if it's the handy size King Jib. I don't know what. I'm just, I'm holding this one, and it actually seems fine with nice soft paper. <laughs> you don't you barely hear anything there. So again, you get all that room there. I really like that. It's interesting that the smaller one, I just can't get over that. Um, would actually be so wide open. So, hey, whatever you did, if you did anything, put it in the comments, man. You know, this lays open so nicely. It's so soft. You know, I'll, I'll get past the small font. It's not too bad for me. I wear my glasses. I have reading glasses. So, so here's the Thompson Chain Handy Size Church Bible Publishers Bound Bible. It's new to my collection. You know, and it's easy when you first get something that's got some impressive stuff. It's like, oh, that's so nice. But it really is. You know? I'm going to pick a few more you know, subjects and chain references, and I'm going to probably go through them tonight. I need it. I need to do Oh, yeah, there's that. Everyone always shows that. Tree of Jesus' life. There's some pretty dark, some good print back here, too. Wow. Yeah, I didn't spend as much time as I should have in the midsize. And this one, you know what, I'm giving it, you know, I'm going to spend a lot more time in this. There is just so much. It's a whole nother book and back, it really is. But you don't want me to go through the whole thing. The Hebrew calendar. See, with what I got now, I don't really need anything else. You get a Thompson chain, I got the Open Bible New King James really need anything else right now so there's the back and guess what it looks like the front synthetic nice okay we'll do a little leather it's got some grain I mean it's it's smoothed out in the sense it's almost like it was flattened a bit I mean you know it doesn't have quite the shine some people call it sheen that some other the these calfskins used to have back um, say two three years ago we know where I'm talking about LCBP um, I like that, you know, it's, I, see, I like this thin calfskin. I thought I was someone who goes, oh, I want a, you know, a thick, mean, you know, leather, you know, the signature series. No, I, I really like this thin leather. So much you can do with it. Anyway. So, all right, there it is. Another one from my collection. I better do this before it cuts me off again. So, thank you, Eric. Thank you for watching. If you don't mind smaller print, by all means, the way this thing is built... The way it feels, the quality, um, the way it lays open, nice and open for you. Get under some good light. I'm going to enjoy this. Have a good night.